Hi guys, I'm Susie Newman. I am currently 36 years old and I'm from Virginia Beach, Virginia. And I have just recently started the transformation in my life into getting healthier and to seeing how far I can push my body physically and mentally. Hired a trainer, um, Chad, at USA Elite Trainers, who has his pro card and who is a beast, um, who pushes me places I never thought I could take my body. Um, hence the gun. So, um, I'm really excited. I actually have a competition that I'm doing in May of 2014. I am 219 days out as of today. Um, so I haven't really started doing anything too seriously other than just getting on board with what I need to do. Um, he's got me on a bunch of different supplements and a bunch of different stuff, and I'm still learning what it is. Um, I'm taking glutamine. Um, I'm taking a pre-elite powder, which is just my just a fruit punch flavor shake I take before I work out. Um, my Prometaline, which is the key to everything I do because it keeps me revved up and going. Um, but I did notice that when I was getting these, my husband and I are both, he's a bodybuilder. Um, when we were doing these, his only had 500 milligrams and mine has six. So there are options out there. If you want more or less, I want more. Um, take our vitamin C. Um, these things are paying the buns to take. They're huge. Um, Got to have your fish oil, um, glucosamine. It's like a, a, it's a drug cartel over here, I'm telling you. Um, you got to have your fiber and more. Um, you got to have your multivitamin. Can't live without your multivitamin. Women take women's multivitamin. Um, and your BCAAs. Now they're they are all in your the 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 um the um everything that's in here are in your protein shake and read the back of your protein shake folks because you would be surprised how much genetically modified stuff is in a protein shake and you think oh protein it's healthy right um no and don't get anything with a lot of sugars because you're just putting more trash in your body um so just really watch what you put in your body watch you know the the vitamins make sure that they don't have a bunch of fillers i actually prefer a liquid vitamin and i do take one and i get mine from omni international and I'm a distributor for them, but it's because that they are liquid and that I'm not wasting a lot of my time with my body trying to process it and get all the junk out and the fillers and stuff. So that's about it. I just wanted to give you guys a quick synopsis of who I am and what I'm doing, and I hope that you guys will click subscribe and um, follow me on my journey, and I will keep you guys updated, and you guys can see how I transform and how I change. I'm currently 5'7", and as of this morning, I was 157 pounds, so... I'm about a size six. Um, everything I wear is a small. Um, so I have to lose about 30 pounds um, in 219 days, which is 30 weeks. So that's a pound a week. So it's not really that much. And I really won't even say, you know, do too much to lose weight right away. I'll just do more muscle training and stuff like that. But I did want to tell you guys one thing before I do leave. Um, every morning I eat my oatmeal and I um, add protein powder. Um, to my oatmeal. If you're doing this journey, you know exactly what I'm talking about every morning, oatmeal and protein powder. Well, um, I hate oatmeal and it's boring and it's disgusting and it looks like mush and they use it on game shows and they call it slop. So, um, I use, I'm sure you guys have all heard of Stevia. Don't use Splendor or any of that yuck stuff. Um, Stevia. And you can get Stevia in, um, sorry, I'm left-handed, so I'm going to switch over here. Okay. So, you can get Stevia um, in a liquid form. Now, if you notice, it says chocolate. So, if you guys do what I do, then you know you have blueberries and raspberries and stuff like that, all these little 100 calorie snacks, nuts, and all that. Well, you guys get really creative. I had almond joy um, oatmeal this morning, and I put in four chocolate stevia drops. I put in a shredded organic coconut, and it was so shredded that it was almost like a powder, a little chunky or grainy or sandy kind of thing um, with some slivered almonds. And you got to watch because all that's got a lot of high, high, high fat. So if you're watching your fats, be really careful. But it's really healthy fat. So um, consider that. And so I put in my chocolate um, protein powder and stirred it up in my oatmeal, added in my chocolate stevia drops, slivered almonds. Hello, coconut almond joyful breakfast. Now, they sell it. A ton of flavors, and I actually get mine here locally at DSD. You can get them online. They sell all kinds of them. They can get really expensive up to $15.99. Um, you can get them as low as $6.99. Just like I said, know what you're buying. But um, orange, um, vanilla, toffee, hazelnut, coconut, 
lime, raspberry, chocolate raspberry. Um, I know I'm forgetting something, but get really creative. I add orange ones to my strawberry smoothie. I want a strawberry orange smoothie. Um, it's, you know, that Starbucks pumpkin spice latte time of the um, year. Don't forget, take your coffee. You come home at the end of the day, you have a coffee left in the coffee pot, throw it in a cup, throw some ice in there, throw in some vanilla um, and some English toffee, some pumpkin pie spice, some cinnamon with a little bit of almond milk, shake it up over ice, I'm telling you, hands down, it's much healthier and better for you, and you're saving yourself five bucks and having a trip to Starbucks. So check those out. Like I said, um, Whole Foods sells them, Trader Joe's sells them, Vitamin Shop. I get these at DSD, Discount Supplements Direct. Um, check them out. They sell them. They're the cheapest in town. So that's it. Here's my tip of the day. Bye, guys. Subscribe, and I'll keep you posted. Bye.